right, guys, it's time for episode 16 of the Conrad Zan player car mode on FC 25. And we are currently sitting second place in the in the Premier League with 19 points, just one point under west ham united who are on 20. we have quite a difficult episode today i mean we're starting i mean the match against Huddersfield is going to be relatively easy i hope that we actually do win that with the simulation then we have aston villa their top team then we have juventus chelsea west ham and atletico madrid so i'm going to be playing the juventus and, and, and atletico madrid match because i want to focus more on the champions league because i mean we haven't won the premier league but i feel like it's something that we should easily do even though we're not really in the best position right now but Juventus and Atletico Madrid are just big matches that I should win rather than I should play regardless Manchester City fans express delight with Conrad Zan being shortlisted for the Ballon d'Or all right so the Ballon d'Or is coming up and I really really hope that we do win it so I mean the fact that we're shortlisted just tells me that we might actually win it because we had a really good season last last year i think that was um i think we got 66 goals in total and we got like 80 something um goal contribution in in general but anyway it's time for the match against Horas field we are away from home so this might be all right nothing really happens we win it vermirin and Foden get the gold and we are through to the next round of the carabao cup all right next up we have aston villa who is currently seventh on the table and i'm going to be playing the highlights of this one so let's hope that we have a really good match here and get a win to see ourselves probably go to the top of the game. i'm actually so stressed i had such a long day today but i mean we have to we have to do the videos either way because I'm trying to do like an everyday thing. I already missed my reaction video for Saturday, which was yesterday. But <laughs> I, I mean, I just couldn't. Like the weekend was just so tough for me. I just couldn't do. I'm, I was I was just very happy that Saturday was for the reaction video, not Conrad Zan. Let's see. Can I? Well, that doesn't work out. Holland and yeah we lost the ball next up we have a manchester city attack i think that means that i'm with the ball yes aston villa is a relatively good team so i need to be careful though all right they have already scored and now we have a oh no turn back can i score with this Nah, they already blocked me off. Uh, I'm trying to get a good good angle. Rodri, can I score like this? And the keeper is able to do something about that. But the thing is, the thing is, um, that right foot thing that I'm doing, the right foot finesse that I'm trying to do. Nice. To get this to Kabore. I don't know why you are that far ahead. And yeah, that just happened. I don't really know what I could have done there, to be honest. But we have another crossing opportunity here. And let's hope that this one does work out. Does it? It does. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. That is so unfortunate. Halan, you are free. No, not really. No way to help. Oh okay shit that would have been so close all right so we lose to aston villa 3-0 damn that was not a very good match but we did get the manager objectives which is a good thing and with that loss we have dropped all the way down to seventh position that is crazy aston villa has gone ahead of us arsenal manchester united liverpool as well even spurs that is bad so, i mean it's not that bad I mean, because the difference between second position and seventh, which is us, is just three points, basically. So another win, if any of them fuck up, we're just going to keep climbing and climbing. So I, I believe that is something that's going to happen. Let's look at the calendar real quick. We are also on top of the Champions League, undefeated three, three wins in three games. All right, so we have Chelsea. That's going to be a tough one, man. And then West Ham. So I forgot that we have an absolutely, a really tough episode. Wait wait a fucking minute are you telling me that i did not win the freaking ballon d'or though are you telling me that i did oh my fucking god 
Vinicius won the Ballon d'Or. We got absolutely robbed. We got absolutely robbed by this game. I cannot believe this shit just happened. How many goals did Vinicius score last season? I can bet that it's not up to you. I think it's because we changed clubs. I think that's the issue. I mean, I really wanted to win the Ballon d'Or as a teenager. We are just 18 though. We're going to turn 19 in december that is next month so next year we're going to still be 19 by the time the um, ballon d'or comes around again we have to do really well to make sure that we can be in that conversation again for the ballon d'or for next year my god i'm feeling sick man i don't know what the hell is up but next up we have um juventus this is going to be yet another tough match and i'm going to be playing the full match for this so let's hope that the front three in Conrad Zahn, Haaland, and Foden can actually do something in this match. Alright, so this is actually what I'm talking about. It's a much better team. I'm not seeing freaking 79, 75 rated players in the freaking defense. So, I mean, it makes me a little bit more confident in the fact that we might possibly... We have a better chance of winning this match. Right now, IRL, I don't know if Juventus has what it takes to take on the current Manchester City team. But, I mean, we're still really good. But I don't know how good the Juventus team is, that's the thing. So, 9.0 match rate, they come four passes in the opponent's half, which will enhance the dribble success rate, because I always, always get that one. So, well, Juventus kicking off, Vlahovic is starting, and, well, let's see if we can have a good match here and get a well-deserved win. Four out of four is what I'm looking for. All right, that's a good shot from Haaland. I would have loved him to like pick me out there, but I mean, it was a really, really tough thing to have been able to do. But can he get a chance here? Maybe I can score with this. And that was actually really, really well struck. Just that it wasn't wide enough to beat the keeper. Nice. All right. So, Haaland, brilliant. Can I score this? Yeah. Oh my God. I had a feeling that I was, I was not going to get that. This time, and the keeper makes yet another save. That is really good from the keeper. All right, let's try this again. Maybe. Ah, that's too high, but that was really close, dude. That was really close, but that is three chances in less than 10 minutes, and we are absolutely lighting these guys up right now. my god i was not expecting him to take that on damn that was a rocket all right so i mean they're going to take a shot but i mean we still have a possible chance for a counter attack never mind folding got completely done there but he still has the ball can i all right edison nice get this out to me thank you all right what can i do here okay take this inside keep going wide all right, Haaland. Oh my god, what is that touch? What the fuck is that touch? Like, that is just so uncalled for. All right, yet again, we're not having a very strong first half. But Haaland, I see you. I think that's too much. That's too much. All right, that was close. Rebrahovic is looking really dangerous here. And Ederson makes another really good save. And that is the end of the first half. We've not had a very good first half which is normal with Conrad Zahn he always always blunts in the first half for for some reason all right Haaland nice who is there Foden we don't get Haaland still with it Trevella maybe and that's a really good shot another really good shot the keeper had to stretch for that one nice oh shit 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 just wasn't enough to beat the keeper Right, we are probably through here. I hope so. All right, we're still with the ball. That's nice. Oh, that was brilliant. That was brilliant. But I should have shot it one time. I should have shot. It one time. I didn't have time for that extra touch. Let's try and get harder than this. Nice. Oh my god, that's a good save. That is a good save. Oh my god, no. All right, Tennyson. Ederson have done really well in this match. The keepers in general have done really well in this match. Looking good here. We just need that final. It's to Haaland. 
please score this definitely no way in the hell that we were going to be missing that and that is the first goal of this match that he comes from no one other than Conrad Zahn. really good play from the boys there and the final pass from Haaland was spot on and we have ourselves our goal and we have ourselves another goal in the Champions League all right nice from Gundogan can I get past this guy no I can't to get it to Simmons Okay, we have another chance here. Maybe. All right. I mean, I was looking for a pass, but like, I don't know if I was tunnel vision or not. But I didn't see one, so I decided to take the shot. I'm hoping that I can get a shot here. Ah, oh, that's what I've been looking for all my life. That sweet connection. I finally did it. But sadly, nothing came of that. But Haaland, get this back out to me. Who is there? Foden, I see you. Back post. Please score. Okay, so I don't know how on earth we didn't score that. I don't know why we didn't take that one time. Well, let's try this again. Haaland, come on. All right. Back out to me. Who is there? Foden, I see you. But well, you're not in a good position to try and score there. All right. Can I? All right. Okay, so I think I'm just going to give up on the finesse with my right leg because it's just not going to happen it's just never going to happen all right ederson nice javi can you get this to me no you can't all right that's the end of the match and we have defeated juventus one nil just one goal we got the goal and that is that is what matters because i really want to try and get the ball on for next season because it's kind of disappointing that we didn't win it this time around we got robbed i'm telling you we absolutely got robbed by this game next up we have chelsea though and this is going to be a relatively good chelsea team because like on paper they're really good but i'm just going to change the key real quick even though it's not really clashing though there's a darker shade of blue so i'm going to be oh shit fucking hell i accidentally picked the team highlights but anyway this is another match that we absolutely have to win we lost the last match in the Premier League against what's their face, Aston Villa. So I need to make sure that, that doesn't happen this time around. All right, so Chelsea is starting with a crossing opportunity, and I believe that um, I can try to stop this. Brilliant. Okay, let's go across the field. Next up, though, Chelsea have a free kick in a very interesting position, but I don't know if he's going to try and go go for a goal with this. Maybe not brilliant but yeah exactly there we never get counter attacks from those i mean it's just the best scenario for a counter attack but you know it's just something that never happens in this game all right so the game finally gives them a taste of their own medicine and let's hope that all right we have a counter attack so this is going to be good Foden, holland and oh shit come on i was even offside all right i'm really really watching this match right now we have an attack though and we are looking to be in a very good position. The ball was stood still. That is very funny. Xavi. Oh my god. That is such a beautiful goal. That is a fucking screamer. I wish I could see the replay of that. That is insane. Chelsea have a solo run now though. And oh shit. Jackson is in a very, very crazy position. I'm going to slap. Never mind. Oh my god, thank god <laughs> that I actually ended up with the ball there. Alright, so I'm going to try my... The thing I like to do a lot here. Let's try and get my player on the ball. Alright, so... Going to play it here. And just get yourself in position, Conrad. Nice. Oh god, he got deflected. Just got deflected. Alright, so we're still with the ball what i swear to god i don't actually understand this game sometimes please don't go out of zone nice Holland. oh shit what the hell is that what the actual hell is that all right so i think we have another okay long cross by chelsea so he's going the other way i thought it was the solo run because i i saw that like it was on this side but all right so we still have the ball we can possibly try to get a another goal here if possible though all right conrad gets to haaland back to conrad 
top inside and that just doesn't work out that's so frustrating all right yeah they actually were supposed to have a chance let's try and make sure that we crap i feel like we're going to get a okay we have another the penalty key for man city all right so we have a chance to score here let's hope that we do score i'm going down the middle i really hope that the keeper doesn't oh shit oh shit the annoying thing is when they don't go down the middle it's so annoying but anyway that's the end of the match we don't score but we do win the match 1-0 a screamer from javi simmons that was such a beautiful goal all right, so next up we have a couple international fixtures but i didn't see this before but let's see if it's just the one or if it's more than one we have just sweden home and you know this west ham match west ham is currently first right they're currently first on the table if i'm not wrong yeah they are they are still first that is crazy we are fifth and that was how much is something that i was going to simulate but now that i look at it i think i actually want to play the match so i'm going to simulate this one really not interested in, in the uh in the european qualifiers right now even though it's something that i should be interested in but i feel like we're, we're going to qualify either ways but the west ham match is something that i want to play i'm always playing the full match there because i have the um match against atletico madrid after after that match i don't know but i feel like i definitely would have gotten a goal or two if i played as just conrad in the last in the last match against what's that face against chelsea but we're playing as just him this time around i accidentally enhanced the wrong one all right so first up is a manchester city counter attack this is looking pretty good if oh my god oh my god that shit happened again this game needs to be fixed they need to fix their shit because it's so annoying well, we have a solo run here though and i believe that all right so holland is looking really good nice i believe that he should score this and that is just crazy that is just crazy that he shot like first time but i mean he's lucky that he got the ball back to him because i would i would have been so pissed if he stole that if he stole that assist away from me all right next up is another counter attack i believe javi simmons holland nice brilliant can i score this and i just wasn't able to get to the far corner but that was really good to get past the defender next up we have another city attack it's not a counter attack there but it's looking like something that i can i don't think i can get that oh i can't actually nice Holland. or phone in anyone oh that would have been so good but why the hell does Holland not get that how the hell does that person tip Haaland over? That makes no bloody sense. All right, Haaland is looking to be in a really good position here. Can we? Nice, brilliant. That is two assists in a row to Haaland. So next up, we have a solo run. I think it's for us this time. And I believe that I should be able to get past... Oh my god. I mean, we still have the ball. Come on. Ah. Uh god that is so it's actually so irritating they've equalized and they've gotten the ball back oh my god and they're going to tell me out of zone immediately my players get the player the ball back we have one more solo run and i believe that i can give this to Haaland one more time if the game doesn't screw me over which they do they absolutely they absolutely do they absolutely fucking do oh my god i'm so pissed off with that i am actually okay what a way to lose this match what a way to lose this match but I, I i don't even have anything to say that is just that is just fucking irritating man we got a 10 point match rating there though so i'm going to be um improving one of my stats i think the crossing on the curve is interesting but there's something i want though i can't get my skill my weak foot up to five star that's the crazy thing so um it's either i switch to a right position where i can actually like utilize that finesse with my left foot because i don't think it's ever going to happen with the right for now i'm just going to stay on the left side of the pitch and try my best to help the team out although i believe that i can actually do way better if i'm on the right or the middle but we don't really get what we want pep believes that we are better off playing on the left 
so on the left we shall play we did really well though in that match against west ham we could have gotten three assists a hat-trick of assists if the game if the game didn't like screw us over there but i mean it's all good we're going into the match against Atletico madrid with our strongest never mind cabore is not supposed to be there i don't know who was there before though but i believe that it's someone that okay young koto was actually is actually higher higher rated than cabore but I believe that we should be able to win this match again. And let's go for five for five. Okay, nice. Please get this to me. Brilliant. Oh shit. Alright, so I probably shouldn't have caught inside. I mean he was he was not in a it wasn't the best position to do that. But let's see if Haaland can do something here. He does and oh my god. Foden and that is such a good save from the keeper. That is such an unbelievable save from the keeper. We're gonna just try it again. Haaland is a lot deeper this time. Can you get ahead on it? And the keeper is able to come out and collect that. Okay, so they're looking pretty threatening here, but they actually waste that completely. And I mean, you could have just passed that to me, bro. Nice. All right, so we are not, we have not found ourselves in a very good position. And I believe that we are going to score this. Right? Definitely. Top bins. And well, that is a good goal from Conrad Zahn. All we had to do was get ourselves in a good position there to receive the pass from Haaland. And when we are already at our top speed, there's no way the defenders are going to be able to catch it. So that is a really good goal. And we have yet another goal in the Champions League. I wonder how many we have in total. All right, so we have beaten a couple of the defenders. Haaland, I need you to be in a better position, but you are not. Please score this. Uh, I probably too, I probably wasted too much time with the pass. But I, I was looking at him and waiting for him to get into a better position. And bro just didn't. So I just had to pass it either ways. I mean, he still got a shot on it, which is good. But I mean, he could have done so much better there. Nice. Get this out to me. Haaland, you're through. Or not. Pass it back. Javi. Nice. Pursue with the ball. Haaland. Can you score this time? No, you cannot. It's the exact same thing, and the keeper does the exact same thing and makes the exact same save twice in a row. Nice from Guardiola. Nice from Guardiola. All right, so that is the end of the first half there. I probably should have been able to get past that player. I don't know why the hell I didn't, because I got to the ball first, and I did the ball roll. But, I mean, it's a good first half. We got a goal, finally. Scoring in the first half. That's something that we don't do often. Okay, free Haaland, and I mean, that was a through pass. I have no idea what that was. And that was an even worse pass to throw in. Bruh, I don't understand the way this game works. I mean, <laughs> it's just so frustrating sometimes. Nice. All right, Foden, are you going to be able to find yourself in a good position here? No, you aren't. But I mean, I'm going to go to loan. That is two goals in this match and 12. I mean, I wanted to pass the field in, but I mean, there just wasn't any point. I mean, we were in on goal, and he was in a very stupid ass position. Like, <laughs> like imagine, Im imagine passing to him like that. That would have made absolutely no sense. Like, imagine passing. I mean, I could have done it earlier. That would have been better, but I mean, bruh, he, he could have gotten himself in a way better position if he wanted the ass, if he wanted the the goal, because I was going to give him if he was in a good position. Brilliant, we're doing really well and we still have the ball. Oh no fucking hell. I was I thought I was with the ball, so I was going to shoot it. I didn't know that Haaland was with the ball. Crap. Okay, do not let them score here. They're looking, they're getting dangerously close to our box. We haven't been here in a while. Alright, come on, Kabori, someone do something. I'm trying not to pull out the wrong players. Alright, that's a very good, a very good um interception or that tackle. All right, Foden, I think, I'm going to, I think it's my time to like cut inside. I don't know what the hell Foden decided to do there. All right, dangerously close to a hat-trick and a 10-point match rating. But um, they are really doing a good job to frustrate me by keeping the ball for like 10 million years. Them still being with the ball is crazy, man. Like, since like the 60th minute or something like that. Tell he's offside. All right, finally we have the ball. Finally we have the ball. And, oh my god, that was... Okay, so... I thought he was going to play out to me. Okay, Haaland. Nice. Can you hold the ball? 
Please, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. I wanted that pass from Haaland. That, that pass will have been best from Haaland, but... Uh, I mean, when the game doesn't want you to succeed, you're not going to succeed at what you're looking for. So that's bye-bye, um, Hattrick, because there's no way we're going to get that now. But I mean, we still had a pretty good match, though. Please get this out to me, thank you. Alright, so that's the end of the match. Good match from Conrad Zahn, good match from Manchester City as a whole. And we are... I don't know how many matches we have to play. I think it's eight matches. And we've already played five, if I'm not wrong. And we've won all five of them. So I don't think that we are going to be at any risk of relegation from the Champions League. So we have actually done really well. We got the Man of the Match award again. I actually want to see what, how well I have done. Um, rather, what the table looks like in the Champions League. But before we do that, we're eighth position. Seven points away from West Ham. That is not good. How on earth, in what world is Manchester City with a team like that, eighth position? It makes no sense to me. I mean, that match against West Ham, we got absolutely, um, we got absolutely robbed, yes, by the game. We got robbed in the Ballon d'Or by FIFA and Vinicius, and we got robbed in the Premier League again with that match against West Ham. And a couple other matches I've played in this episode, to be honest, this episode has just not been it for me. But in the Premier League, rather in the Champions League, we are doing really, really well. Arsenal is in fourth position, so they are, if they keep up the form that they're in right now, they're going to be automatically in the round of 16, if I'm not wrong. They will have to play the playoffs. Let's look at the teams that are at a risk of um, getting eliminated. We have Salzburg, Villarreal, Werder Bremen, Juventus. That's crazy. Sporting, Lisbon, Chelsea. That's another team that I really didn't think that they were going to be there. Okay. So, we have Celtic, Mainz, Slavia, Praha. Those teams, I'm actually quite shocked. But, I mean, we still have, like, three more matches to go, I believe. So, I think that those teams that are weirdly in, the, in that zone might actually, like, find their way out or, or not i don't know i don't really care about other teams to be honest this has been a good episode if you have enjoyed the video make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already turn on your post notifications so you'll be notified on when i drop new videos i drop them daily so um thank you once again for watching and i'll see you in my next video peace